Hi, my name is Caitlin Havikin, and I'm super excited to serve as one of your drum majors this year and the Campbell University Marching Band. Today in the quarantine package, we are going to work through some different commands that we have on the marching band field. First, I wanna to talk to you about the most important position we ever stand in, attention. This is really important that you stay focused and centered. First, we're going to look at the feet. We are gonna have them at a 45 degree angle. It's important that you take a fist and it's about a fist size um, length between the two of your feet. Moving up even further, we're coming to our legs. It's important that your knees are not bent like this, but that they're not locked, okay? If your knees are locked and you stand in that position for a long period of time, then you're more apt to pass out. And we do not need that this season. So keep them kind of relaxed. Like I said, not bent, but relax. Okay, moving up even further, our torso, we want to keep it um, aligned and we're not wiggling, moving, we're not like this, we're not like this, but we're kind of centered. Moving up even further, your shoulders, you want to keep your shoulders kind of back. You want to have this prideful position because when we get to the head, your head is going to be kind of up with kind of an L, sh L shaped with your hand and it's going to be um, facing forward. You want your face to be towards um, the press box at all times. This will help with our horn angles. Okay, coming up with our arms, we're going to come to a horns down position. This is not necessarily a 45 or a 90 degree. I'm, I'm not good at math. I'm meant to be a music major for a reason. Um, so we're going to kind of keep our arms bent, pulled out away from our body, not close, not all the way out here, but just comfortable enough. Okay, this is our attention position. Again, checking our um, head, you're going to do uh, the what we call the L shape. Okay, this is kind of a very prideful position. To come to this position, we are going to do um, this command. It goes like this. The drum major will go one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four, bang, ten, up. Your response is C, U. Okay, again, that goes one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four, bend, ten, hut, C, U. Very staccato in your C and in your U, okay? Cool, so kind of snapping together how this comes if we're at a relaxed position and the drum majors go, bend, ten, hut, C, U. You're always resting on one. You're resting on the C and you're snapping together on the U. To show you one more time, Bend, ten, hut, see, you. So that's our attention position. When we're coming out of attention position, one of the directors may say, relax. That is when you can come to a relaxed position and you need to stay by your dot and you cannot, don't move away from it. You're just coming to relax, meaning you don't have to stand at this strict attention position. Okay, um, come set is another term that we will use. That is when we're saying, come set, come to attention position, we're getting ready to move on to the next part of our drill. And then moving further, parade rest. Parade rest, we're going to have our feet out, our hands are gonna be down, and your head is gonna be down, um, kind of directed down to the ground. And that is parade rest. Again, we have attention, parade rest, and come set. So be sure to learn all of those. Now we are gonna learn about horns up and horns down. The command for horns up is bam, horns up. To do a horns up, you're going to take your arms and you're gonna snap it up to your face. Your fist is coming to the level with where your mouth is. So like if you were a trumpet player, like you're getting ready to play, okay? Here's the command. Bam, horns up. To show you it all together from the side, Bend, horns up. You always pause on the first. So think, bend, horns up, pause up. And make sure it's snappy, ready? Bend, horns up. To do bend, horns down. Bend, horns down. And remember, you're always pausing on one. Here's it from the side. Bend, horns down. Very snappy every single time. Bend, horns up, bend, horns down. Now to show you from the front. Bend, 
horns up, fan, horns down. Great, so now that you've learned those, we are going to talk about how to dress. It's important when we're marching that we always dress with people, and there are specific commands for this. The first command we're gonna learn is to dress right. The drum major or director will say, dress, right, dress. As you are in attention position, you are going to turn your head and dress to the right. So the command is, dress, right, dress, pause, look. Again, that's dress, right, dress, pause, look. The next one is dress, left, dress. Hint, it's the same thing as dress, right, dress, um, but you're just looking in the left direction. Dress, left, dress, pause, look. Great, so those two are about the same thing. When we um, come forward, it's gonna, the drum major director will say, ready, front, and then you pause, look back to the front. Ready? Let's do all three of those together. Dress, right, dress. Ready, front. Dress, left, dress. Ready, front. This time we're going to learn about how to mark time and how to halt. The command for mark time is mark, time, mark. We always start with our left foot. And it's important that when we're marking time that we first bring our left foot in and then our right foot in. When you're marking time, your toes never leave the, never leave the ground. You're simply coming up with your heel. Left, 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 left. Great, let me show you that whole thing together. I'm at attention position. The command is mark time, mark, left, right, left, right, left, right, left, right. Now as I'm going, I need some way to halt, okay? The command for band halt is band halt. And then your feet are going to place open. Mr. Barnes really likes it when we say place open. We say it in our head to help us know that we're placing our feet open. So if I'm marking time, left, the command is band hold, place, open. When you're placing an opening, your right foot is coming out and then your left foot is coming out. To show you one more time, marking time, band hold, place, open. So now we're gonna learn how to forward march. To do this, we need to make sure we engage our core and really balance. So the command is Forward, march. So when we're marching forward, we're bringing our left foot forward because what foot do we always start with? Our left foot. And we're gonna balance using our core on the heel of our left foot and the toe of our right foot. Do you see how I'm kind of rocking back and forth? We want our leg to be kind of straight, kind of bent, I'm not like, bending but I'm not like locked forward because remember we never lock our knees in marching band okay and I'm kind of rolling forward the step that we're using is a roll step that's what I'm getting at when I'm saying that we're rolling okay so when we're forward marching take a look at my feet forward march So when I'm marching, you'll see that the tops of my, the top of my foot right here, you want to be able to see like if there's a smiley face sticker on there. Okay, we want to be able to see that. And we're making sure that our feet are coming forward and we're really rolling and we're pushing our body forward. And that's how we forward march.